now then, I know you're enjoying the frequent uploads, you know, because the last battle was uh, pretty close, you know, three weeks. But yeah, moved out to university in my new flat, and yeah, but you didn't click on this video to even hear about that, you clicked for the battle. So, Wagwan people, it is I, Sour Bows, bringing our match against Dragon finally, Smog on Wi-Fi Battle Finder, you get the gist of it. Big threats on um, his team is definitely the Conkelder. I hopefully I'll get rid of that straight away. As you can see, obviously led out, yeah, led out with it. And also Heatran is a big problem for this team. I should probably put Hidden Power Ground on Volcarona because I do pack Giga Drain. Because if Dugtrio is dead um, and Heatran's on Balloon, it kind of favors my team. <laughs> but you can also see that um, Fortress is out of the picture because it's not very good this generation and. Replaced with Zatu, it's pretty much uh, my signature death order anyway, so... <laughs> and plus magic bounce will be helpful. So either way, without further ado, let's get on with the show. As he leads off with the biggest threat, Conkelda. Pretty much a big threat to any hell team, so it's more the playstyle anyway. As I'm gonna switch out into my Robert Furt, so after I've gone my hair luck, cause he does have a weather reducer of his own, so yeah. My hail is here to stay, obviously. <laughs> and yeah, he goes right for the drain punch. I'm going to switch into Wobbuffet. You can see that um, hail hits me first, so going for the Encore will be pointless. So what I'm going to do is just going to go for the counter. If he decides to go for Payback, I can counter that. If he decides to go for the Ball Cup, I can Encore him next turn because I do outspeed. And But he's more inclined to just um, go in the Payback, which I thought kind of weird, but hey, I'm not complaining. That's a threat gone. As Conkelda is down for the counts, I go for the Encore again as he switches into Hydreigon just in case he was the substitute variant. But he decides just to go right for the Dark Pulse, kills him off my Wobbuffet, and now I'm just going to go into my Volcarona. You see no item, so he's probably either Choice or Exo Belt because that's the most common in Black and White 1, but it's Black and White 2, so I don't know what I'm talking about. Gonna go right for the Bug Buzz instead of going for Quiver Dance, predicting he switched to Heatran because, again, I need to take care of the um, Heatran Balloon. I, do, I need to figure out if it's carrying the Balloon or not, which he is after I kill off the Hydreigon with a Modest Bug Buzz, which was, again, kind of weird how he just stayed in like that, but... Either way, Balloon's popped on the Heatran, and he missed the Magma Storm, which, um, if you don't know, is um, Heatran's signature move, where it's basically kind of like Whirlpool, and you're trapped, and has the same accuracy as Will-O-Wisp, so, yeah. And has the same base power as Fire Blast, I think, but because Fire Blast is more accurate, people use it. Now here, I make a... I consider this a pretty b big misplay, seeing as he's able to get rocks up. I should have foddered off um, the Zatu, which I should have done, but I wasn't in the <clears throat> right state of mind. I'll go... <clears throat> anyway. He keeps missing the <laughs> Magma Storm, which is absolutely hilarious. I wanted this thing to die, and <laughs> I've been... Hitting it with times four resistant moves, wood hammer and bug buzz and it's beautiful. <laughs> Man, I'd be pissed. But hey. That's your own fault for um running Magnuson, but whatever. As he does switch into his um Ferrothorn, I see that he's got rocket helmets and now I'm predicting to go for the spikes. As he just does that, seeing as I don't want any more hazards, so I've already screwed up. Um, keeping rocks off of my side of the field, so at least I can get spikes um, not on my side anyway. As thanks to Black or White 2, Move Tutors, Zatu does pack the Heat Wave now with Magic Bounce. As he does uh, yeah, decide to go for the um, Power Whip for whatever reason, I guess he had nothing else for it. And oh no, he probably thought that the um, Zatu couldn't touch him anyway, so that's why he stayed in and just to get some decent damage. Or thought I'd U turn anyway. But here, because I did show Heat Wave, he's probably thinking, oh, I can get a Flash Fire boost now, but that's far too obvious for me. Gonna go right for U turn and then switch out into my Dug Trio so I can go for the Choice Bandit Earthquake and easily trap this thing with Arena Trap and KO it easily, easily. And all those times 4 resistant moves have <laughs> gone the better of him. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. But anyway. Heatran goes down, and now he is going to decide to bring out the Donphan. Takes the spikes damage, courtesy of his own Ferrothorn. Going to switch out into my Bomb Snow as Death Fodder, seeing as yeah, that's the only that's the most expendable thing on my team right now. As he does go for the Ice Shard because I am a lonely nature, which is plus attack minus defense. 
yeah, and plus I'm excellent battle. Um, this Asha does do a lot of damage, but for some reason, again, you, you can see I'm saying it's for some reason quite a bit, because this battle is clearly not the best. But hey, I need content. He doesn't go for the Arshad again, which probably would have killed me. But, and he had no reason not to go for it either, because even if um, we would have a recall, obviously he KOs me after that. But again, each to their own. Double down. I'm going to bring in my Volcarona, seeing as that's the most weakened thing on my team. As he's going to bring out the um, Kyurem. Here, I forget that I am modest, so <laughs> I was actually in a panic. I was like, oh god, I've got to upload a <laughs> Kyurem sweep. No! <laughs> but anyway. Jinx um, outspeeds and yeah, that's the first turn of sleep and hopefully if I do get a substitute up that is actually a good game. Seeing as um, plus two Okos after um, a nasty plot and, he do and the Kyurem does stay asleep so yeah that's good game. Dragon finally, he decides to run because he doesn't want to be subjugated to um, Jinx sweep but who, <laughs> who yeah, I can't blame him honestly but yeah. Uh, try and find some more battles for you, hopefully better ones, but yeah, yeah, I have no idea how I'm gonna end this off, apart from, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys on the other side. Yeah.